Morning everyone, welcome back to another fossil hunting video. Just heading back from a very unproductive fossil hunt. So I thought I'd film an intro and an outro for a video that should be going up today that shows an amazing ichthyosaur paddle. So definitely watch the video right to the end so you can see the find. I filmed this video about a month or two ago, but unfortunately the intro and the outro had been totally ruined by the wind. So I thought I'd better film another so you can hear exactly what I'm actually saying. If you're new to the channel, please consider hitting that subscribe button so you can see more of my fossil hunting videos and more of my fossil collection. Also, if you enjoyed it, give the video a like as well. Thanks. So for anyone who doesn't know, ichthyosaurs were marine reptiles that swam in the Jurassic Seas roughly 180 million years ago. They were top predators back in the day and they basically ate anything that moved, including other ichthyosaurs. And they're now one of my favorite fossils to find on the beach. big duck by the look of it it's quite pyritic so most likely it won't split well but it's worth probably giving a tap just in case it pops out really nice nice piece of fossilized wood otherwise known as jet or whitby jet not very good quality because it's quite pyritic but it's still lovely just to see on the beach. Right then guys, I've had a few decent finds today. I'm really pleased with what I found, so I'll show you what I found. Right then, so this is that beautiful piece of an ichthyosaur paddle. If you remember a few videos ago, I found something which is the exact same preservation and it even has the piece missing like here. So I'm hoping it'll fit together. I will show you at the end, both pieces put together, they might just fit together. But you can tell there's a good few paddle digits in there. Bigger ones like here, and you can see the notch. And then there's a few smaller ones as well. So that's definitely the find of the day, I think. So this was literally, as you saw right at the beginning, just sat on the beach there'd been probably 10 or 12 people dog walking or just walking on the beach footsteps all around it and no one had bothered or known to pick it up and give it a tap so of course I did because I can't resist myself and inside was this beautiful Hildoceros ammonite a real corker and a nice split I'm trying to decide whether I want to try and knock more of it off or leave it as it is. So now I've got these little bits, a few duck nodules, maybe a few lobster nodules if we're lucky. And this Hildoceros which I picked up, 
it's quite thin so it's probably crushed and there's a bit missing here so I'll give it a chisel or a tap with the hammer and if we're lucky it might be a good break if not then it's a shame and there's this broken hildoceros which I thought it'd be fun just to give you some more fossil splitting content and give it a tap with the hammer right then so I guess I'll start with this one I'll probably give it a tap and we'll see if it breaks well Three, two, one. Maybe it'll be tougher than we thought. Oh, there's a split gone round. You see there's a crack going around there. So I'm going to try tapping it there and maybe it'll all come loose. That bit's just come off. Are you ready? Oh yeah! Lovely split. Time for a few more. So this was a nice nodule. Lovely shape. So let's give it a split now. Let's have a look if there was anything inside. Oh wow! <laughs> Let me get that in the sunlight. <laughs> wow, what a corker! Beautiful golden dark. I'll be honest, I wasn't really expecting that, but <laughs> I'll take it. Let me get a close up of that sparkling in the sunlight. A beauty. Right then, time for me to try splitting this hildy now. Let's see how it does. All right, split. Here we go. Do you think it'll be any good? Another beauty. Just can't beat popping hildes and dacks. Best feeling ever. Right then, so I think I'm going to have an attempt at splitting that hildy down a little bit more. There's a few bits on the side, which I think most likely will pop off really well. So I'm going to go and give it a split now.
There we go, a perfect hilde, prepped on the beach with just a hammer and chisel. Right then guys, hopefully you enjoyed this video. In a minute I'm going to show you the paddle what I've just found today and I'll compare it to the piece of paddle that I found last week and you can see for yourself hopefully it fits together when I'm at home and it is from the same creature I'm pretty sure it will be because the preservation looks pretty much the same hello everyone I'm back up from the beach now and I'm just comparing the paddle digits that I found today to the paddle digits which I found a few weeks back and I'm pleased to say that they join up perfectly as you can see they're an exact match if you look in the cross section you'll see the shapes are exactly the same and they're a perfect fit so I'm well chuffed with that a perfect match but to my surprise another one of my finds actually fits onto the end of here so it's even bigger than I thought so it goes right to there you can see the paddle digits get smaller towards the right hand side and here they're really big on the left but again a perfect match you can see there's a, a little rib sticking out there and it goes on perfectly so I'm well chuffed with that there we go it's a very long piece and on the back there's more paddle digits and there's some ribs I will post the video of this piece when it's fully prepared and all cleaned up if this video reaches 100 likes hopefully you've enjoyed this video I think the paddle should be absolutely stunning when it's fully prepared it's not a complete paddle but it is a good portion of a really big it for your saw and it'll look really nice especially how it's got ribs running over the back of it remember guys if you did enjoy this video please give the video a like and if you want to see more of me and my fossil hunting videos subscribe to my youtube channel and then you can see more of me and my fossil collection if you want to watch more of my fossil videos there's a playlist popping up now that you can click and you can watch more of my interesting finds See you next time.